Oh, yes. oh. Yeah. he cut off the airbag and kept driving it. Yeah, that this is this is what the doctor's looking for when he tells you turn to your turn your head and cough. He's looking for, and this pops to make, out. Yeah, he's looking to make sure that that didn't happen. <laughs> Gross. Welcome back to Collector Car Feed, your inside look at hunting, buying, and selling collector cars online. Today is another ranking session where we take a look at recent for sale listings on Facebook Marketplace and give our honest opinions. We already did the S13 Nissan 240SX a while back, go watch that if you haven't, link below. But today, we are going to follow up with the 1995-1998 to S14 240SX. Powered by the same 155 horsepower naturally aspirated straight 4 KA24DE as the 91 to 94 S13, the S14 brings mid-90s soap bar styling to the table along with front airbags. There really isn't much else to know. The S14 adds less than 100 pounds to the curb weight over the S13, although I'm told it also adds substantial chassis rigidity and superior suspension geometry. There are no year-over-year -year changes worth noting aside from a mid-generation facelift for the 97 to 98 model years, which includes some angry headlights and reworked tails. That's really all there is to know about the car itself. As far as pricing goes, not many of these have ever sold on Bring a Trailer, but it's safe to say a clean, low mileage S14 of either headlight variety should be capable of fetching over 10 grand US in current year, while the later, angrier S14 Kuki, or Koki if you demand perfect pronunciation, which we will not be adhering to for the rest of this video, should be running deep into the teens or even the low 20s, not that we're going to be finding many with under six figure mileage on Facebook today. Finally, we found all of the cars we looked at today using CollectorCarFeed.com, so if there is a Neo Classic car you're searching for, be sure to check out the site, link in description. We make it easy to find exactly what you're looking for without all the hassle and nonsense of actually using Facebook Marketplace. With all that out of the way, here we go. Wait, we're gonna pull up some, like, some stats? Facts? Yeah, yeah, sure. Here's a ton of them. You're seeing a lot of 15 grand. I think 15, gra 15 grand is probably, like, peak, you know? 15 to 20 is, like, creme de la creme. I think that's probably accurate. Wow, there have not been a lot of S14s sold on Bring a Trailer at all. This is all no. of them. 18 total S14s sold on Bring a Trailer ever. Minus one for the Gary Duncan. Oh yeah, the Gary Duncan got pulled at 19K. And it would have been like one of the most expensive ones ever sold. If he hadn't shipped his own car. Yeah. If he was just real about it, it still would have fetched record price. So it's going to be hard to say exactly how to pin this down. I just think the teens for a clean one is is what you're looking for. Yeah, no more than 20. Like if it's a really clean all stock one, 20. But like, yeah, 90k 15. miles on this one. It's a kooky, so or cokey if you like. Fifteen thousand seven hundred seventy-seven dollars. This is this is a really nice S14. Yeah, that that that's basically kink right there i cannot imagine we'll see a nicer one than this on facebook marketplace yeah not on facebook but but i'll, I'll easily imagine that we'll see higher prices oh yes <laughs> but also okay so this one's 90k also this is an automatic okay who so cares? at that point who cares it's it, such it, a it cheap swap matter. too like it, yeah you're right it really yeah. doesn't even matter on an s14 like you're talking about like maybe two grand on like the very very high end for swapping yeah lines. and that's to have somebody else do all the work here is one with 140k and a Turbo and probably an SR swap for 18,000. Here's one with 133,000 miles for 15 grand. Here is one for 79k miles, $15,000, uh, March 30, 2022. Again with an automatic. What what the hell is going on here? I don't. I like. I feel like these are all like C or maybe even B tier cars. Yeah, like this, like, these aren't no even like that nice for 240s. Like, yeah. Like, I guess they just haven't made it to bring a trailer yet. That's kind of weird. 152,000 miles on this one. It's swapped to an SR20 DET wow. and sold for 22 grand. Man, it went for 22? So what? that's that's the peak, man. Like like 20, 22,000 dollars is as high as an S14 can possibly Got an out. SR20 swap, and wow, look at that engine bay. Yeah, it's, it's got a Takata green engine bay, too. So all you gotta do wow. is buy an automatic, swap it, and put it on bet. Yeah. Easy money. Here's every single one that sold in 2021, and none sold in 2020, which is just fucking wild 59,000 miles on this one this is a import $19,250 it's a K's so it's got the SR20 DET in it here's one with like a fucked up hood that so the one that came with an SR20 sold for the same price as one that somebody swapped an SR20 <laughs> yeah that's kind of weird right that's nuts to me S14s just haven't gone up yet I guess but what is going on with this thing yeah what 
This 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 one has like vitiligo. And it's like one of the worst colors these came in. And it's it's a an alright color, but yeah, it's not like the co the color doesn't bother me. The hood is is what the fuck were they thinking? Like yeah, that's at least spray paint it black. Like what the fuck? It looks like they spray painted aircraft remover. Like it's fucked. <laughs> all right, eighteen thousand dollars on this one. This one only does have forty thousand miles. We have a basis. Let, let's yeah. Let's go to Facebook. All right, nineteen ninety six Nissan two forty SX seventy five hundred bucks. Clean title, no trades. This is not a show car or show car quality. We we know one hundred sixty four thousand on the buy seventy five hundred bucks running S fourteen. If you say if you say this is not a show car, it's much that worse. That is basically saying yeah, hey, this, <laughs> this car is this car is a piece of shit. <laughs> you may as well say that. Look at that wow. <laughs> bullet holes. No <laughs> kit. I don't know. That's a weird one. Wh like why? What was going on? Just a, did somebody shoot from the inside with like a twenty-two? <laughs> yeah. yeah, like you had somebody, somebody in the, the trunk. trunk. Is that yeah. what happened? F. That's seventy-five hundred bucks. F. D. What are you gonna do with it? D. You drift this thing. Seventy five hundred dollar yeah, yeah. drift car. You can't beat that. That's a D or okay. C even. Yeah, yeah. Well, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So no. seventy seventy five hundred for this or sixty eight hundred for that gold one on a bat. Absolutely sixty eight hundred for that gold one on a bat. But that's like you can't buy things. Well in the then, past. suck my. So you. would. So you're would. All right, you guys are right. This is a C. So here we have <laughs> ninety five twenty five grand. Plano, Texas, hundred thirty k. Cracked out price. Looks great. Look it does great. look good, though. Yeah, yeah, I agree. Crack RB25 out price. Oh. swap. Okay, okay. Oh. Okay. Bunch of shit. Is that a DVD player? Got a DVD player in there on the roof for some reason. VIP not. Tight. That's $200 alone just in, in fucking rope hanging off of his rear view. <laughs> <laughs> I think D. I'm, I think D. He's overpriced. Yeah. Maybe you can work it down a bit. Omega157 says, What did you guys decide for front end swap cars? Uh, we decided they're... Sheesh. I, I mean, I guess it depends on what front end you're swapping to and from. It's never going to raise the value of whatever no, you're doing. Never. Yeah. Like, never. if you're talking going from, like, uh, only Kooky Only to, to children. <laughs> only to children is, is when it's going to raise the value. Accurate. I mean, if it looks cool to you, do it, whatever, but it's not going to raise the value of your car no matter what it is. I mean, Netgear admitted to liking a horrific looking Supra earlier, so I mean, there's, you know, there's, it's, it's in the eye of the beholder, honestly. God, he's still so it mad didn't about look, that. It didn't look bad. They'll slide. 96, coupe, 10 grand, 122,000 miles, low mileage motor, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Car doesn't run at the moment. Low mileage motor doesn't run. Drives great when running. Cut up. Nope. What is this engine swap? That's an RB25 Neo. Okay. Yep. But it doesn't so run, so... It's a <laughs> incomplete engine swap. Painted bay. Look at that shaved bay, though. Yeah, this is not his car. This is his car. Yeah. Are you sure? Well... This might be what it looked like before. That might be b the before picture, but this is the now picture. Yeah. Like, it was, it's, it's, it's been trash. Yeah. You don't want to buy this guy's project? No. This, nope. This, I, I don't even Not care. Not for 10 grand. Like, like we, we could debate over whether this is a D or an F, but I'm just going to no, give it an it's, F. it's an F. It's an F. This one's 130,000 miles, $8,000 two days ago in California somewhere, blah, blah, blah. <sighs> Rough. Yeah. Rough no, as hell. You know Rough. what? I think, I think I'd rather buy that one on Branch Hill for, for 6100 <laughs> You can't yeah. go back in time to 2021. They're 15 grand well, now. Well, whatever. I'll, I'll buy it. That's Oof, right. This you car has seven different colors. Yeah, no, this sucks anyway. This is... Uh, all right, so this is... This is cancer on every level. If you wanted a project, it'd be a D. I feel like eight grand is kind of low for a 240, but this is kind of shit for a 240. What are you going to do with this? Paint it. Drift it. Swing that ass. <laughs> Four grand. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. Please read. It is our best offer. We'll take trades. Has ISIS parts. Motor was pulled. Does not come with dash. Show your shell. <laughs> $4,000 shell with nothing inside. Why are we even doing this? This is... They're F. all going to be... They're all going to be Fs. How about if... Off first picture, if it looks like an F, we'll just skip it. Because 240s are going to be terrible. Right? Yeah. All right, yeah. F. Uh, one, two, three, four dollars. Only interested in potentially trading for an S13. So we F. don't care F. 98,000 miles, $9,500. Selling ASAP. Hit me up with your offers. Ooh. Ooh. Wide body. Bumper's fucked. Yeah, this thing's pretty rough. <sighs> body kit's a different color. 9,500 bucks. Yeah, I gotta go D. $10,000 sold three days ago. 125,000 miles. 
shot paint. Omega157 in YouTube says, never thought I'd see an S14 with a case of the shingles. <laughs> <laughs> Stock engine, can't hate that too much, I'd... although there's some weird stuff going on over there. 10 grand? Uh, this is like right on the edge of a D, man. Nice interior. It's well, it's been cracked on the middle of the dash. Yeah, right, but what, I'm, what, I'm, what, I'm, what, what S14 oh, yeah. isn't. Oh, uh, Necker's mom's in the room. Yeah. Yeah. Tight. I told her like an hour ago to bring me a fucking this an orange juice, and she finally God, brought it. God damn it, mom. 240 SE swap with RB25, clean title, rare nowadays, trades welcome, no bikes. This Damien? Scroll down. Is this Damien, Monty? Damien. Fucking F. 60,000 miles? That's gotta be on the swap, dude. Gotta be. There's no, no way. No 60,000 mile S14 looks like this. No. F. 96. Manual 5 speed, purchased a few years ago and drove it 5 to 10 times, 100% stock, except for aftermarket suspension, wheels, painted some interior trim pieces, and a subwoofer. So this was a 17-year-old's car. And it's got shot paint, real shot. Well, how much is he asking for? And also it's been sitting for years, uh, $12,000. Oh, no. No. <laughs> no. That, no. that, dude, that paint is shot. Look, go back, go back one. Yeah. Look at that. Yeah. It looks it looks like the reflection of trees from above, but it's inside <laughs> of a shop. <laughs> like that's how shot it is. That's step F. That's F just based on the work you gotta do. I mean, it's a yeah. lot of work. It's 12, a lot of work for twelve grand. We're gonna be you're, we're gonna be really judgmental on this one because you have to be when you're looking at two forties. You gotta. Especially because you know the market's gonna come eventually for S fourteens. Yeah. Here's a crash bar piece of shit. I hate this. 150,000 miles, $13,000. Project. Project car. Track use Ew. only. It's a K24DET, and it's a car is non-op registration off-road use only. Will not pass smog. So it's in California, but it also kind of sounds like it doesn't have a title. So basically it's a golf cart. Yeah, F. Yep. Oof. $3,000, Houston, Texas, 63,000 miles. 3K OBO, don't mind the okay. shoes. For 3K, I'm not going to shit on it. No. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> that's why, that's why the said, paint don't is mind fucked. the shoes, guys. Okay, post feet. <laughs> <laughs> I see the shoes, let me see the feet. Well, now you're on a list. What's up with all the green shit on the front? What is going on there? Is there like the moss? For 3000 who gives a shit? Take it. Repaint it, and you have a baller car. If it's actually 63K, this is an yeah. inst- Yeah, it is. This is 63K on the chassis. This is an S, dude. This is actually an S. This actually might be an S. No, it's not an S. It's an A. It's an A. It's an A because you gotta paint it. But You like, gotta paint it. You gotta paint it. Fair. But is still. This manual swap it. Difficult thing. No. no. On these, it's very simple. No. Very straightforward. Well, swap. damn. That's. This is yeah. a bad car then. Yeah. Once you do the it, work. It could be. As long as it doesn't have a salvage title or severe rust, this is uh, absolutely an A. Give me the shoes and it's an S. <laughs> yeah. Agreed. Oh, the feet. And is it's that an anime S. or. Let me smell those Both. Tims. 120,000 <laughs> miles on this one, $1. Looking to trade for an R6. F. 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 This dude went out and take his pictures at midnight. Centennial, Colorado, twelve thousand dollars on this Z Zinky nineteen ninety five that's been swapped to a Kuki. Has a goofy body kit on it. One hundred twenty seven thousand miles, clean title. SR twenty swapped also. And what's he want for it? Body's rough as hell, but twelve thousand oh, dollars. Damn. No. Way. All right. Well, but wait a minute though. Six thousand dollars an engine. Yeah, but you paint it, and that's apparently according to Bring a Trailer, this is worth twenty. I don't know if there's any that have sold with a wide body kit on Bring a Trailer though. The, true. the paint, the paint isn't gonna hide those body lines. No. <laughs> true, 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 true. But there's a All lot right. of parts in here, honestly. Like this isn't. I, I would terrible. be fine saying C. I go C. No. Ooh. Ten grand, hundred forty thousand miles, automatic. I'll buy this one with the last one. All, Original all KA with an auto. Oh yeah. Look at the rocker. Oh. No. Oh. Oh damn. There's no fixing that. That's crusty. Yeah. No, that's that's bad. You know the the underbody of this is even worse. Ten grand at D F. I mean, it's D things gonna fold in half. 
Yeah, yeah F. F. Pending. 100, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 miles. I am not 100% sure I'm ready to do this, but I am seeing what may come of it. I don't need to sell, but have been considering for a while. Let's jump to the point both cars run and are knocking in the bottom ends and will need rebuilds. <laughs> Plural. What's in the back there, though? Only looking to sell the S14. A fox body? Okay, this is terrible. Whatever's going on here, man. This is like meth, Jimmy O. 4,500 for the S14, 10K OBO for both cars, but they're both ratted out pieces of shit. This is an F for our purposes. This is an How F. did he break both of their engines? Drifting. You're a re. <laughs> yeah. A dr I mean, yeah, it's a drifting. What's a SR worth with bottom end issues? <laughs> it's worthless. It's, it's garbage. Junkyard. Yeah. Yeah. A regular SR is worth, you know, 6,500 bucks. Yeah. Okay, so subtract all the work that you're going no, to have to do. No, not even, not even. It's probably worth nothing. It, it's five grand right now on eBay for an entire swap. So a fucked SR is worth scrap. Maybe if the head is 300 good, bucks, yeah. Okay. You know? Yeah, so we're looking at scrap garbage. And also, yep. you could part these out, but who's going to be buying all these dented up shitty parts? Yeah. <laughs> well, and that's it. Like, you'd be, you wouldn't be able to part the motors. You'd just be parting everything else with it, and that's uh, tough to get into. Yeah, this is it's just it. This just ain't it. This Basically, nope. this, this guy needs to part them out. That's what he needs to do. Yeah. Here's a $4,000, 130,000 mile, 96, listed five days ago in Racine, Wisconsin. KA24DE five speed swapped, good. Welded diff, bad. Fortune coils, Ugh, eh. Fine. A uh, bunch of bullshit, okay. PCV delete, whatever, none of this matters. Uh, let's look at the body, it's rough. It's really Welded nice. diff, just bad. Oh news. my god. If this one's been hit in the quarter. Is that aluminum foil? <laughs> no, it's been, somebody lighted it. It's been hitting a quarter and some old timer did the body work. And some hot rodder yeah. from the 40s got in on this yeah. thing. <laughs> you don't, you don't see that anymore. Brazed it. Cause you don't, yeah, you don't see that anymore. Cause all those guys are dead. <laughs> <laughs> from working with lead. The greatest generation. Yeah. yeah. The guy who was who working goes? on this probably died. <laughs> His son selling it. That's why it, that's why it looks like this. I, this is a D. All these cars fucking suck, dude. Yeah, they yeah. really do. If you're buying a 240, you're an idiot. Yeah, wait, well, like, for, if you're... wait, wait for wait for my wait for my 240 run to come out. Like <laughs> maybe this Monday, maybe depending on when feed edits it. But it's gonna be at least you're... next Monday. But it's coming. Ah, uh, it... like you're look. an idiot. You're an idiot if you're buying one of these cars. Here's the thing: an S14 is probably gonna pop off on B. I'm bringing a trailer. Within the next five years, are you willing to make that commitment to buy this car and hold on to it for five years? Right. That's 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 really what we're looking at here, right? Like, are these cars, so these maybe C, B cars, if we find any, they worth holding on to for three to five years and hopefully turning a profit on Bring a Trailer? Because that's really what you're looking at. It's all, it's, it's dreamers, man. It's dreamers. The cars, the cars that are going to bring money are the fucking pristine ones. You're not going to get th this piece of shit one here. But if you've got three to five years to work on it. Yeah, but I mean, think about, okay, it's so like, think about your man hours and how much that's worth, right? And, uh, and, uh, and also think about your average 240 owner. Yeah. Is the average 240 owner going to, like, like, like how me and Sadly are, you know, going to work to make a car as stock or as clean as possible? No. They're just they're they're idiots and they're like oh. You, what you about your great I, replacement theory? Your your great S chassis replacement theory? Yeah, the the great replacement. Yeah. Is, is that coming for the S14? It will soon, but the S13 is the hot car right now. And the S13, yeah. I mean, look at this picture. Look at the S13 in the background. Like these are like these cars are still in the wrong hands, right? Yeah. Like, like we still haven't finished replacing them yet. S14s are going to jump in value eventually, but I don't think they're yeah. ever going to be anywhere near as valuable as an S13. Benjamin Casperger from the YouTube, does that mean I should sell mine? Yes, in three years. Yeah. Well, no, no. Sit, sit on if for yours, a If yours is clean, you need to keep it. Andrew says, literally every 240 has been terrible. Well, not literally, but everyone Most of we've them. seen, yeah. Yeah. You really won't make any profits on most 240s. Lunar says you really won't make any profits on most 240s 
to be honest, though. Yeah, you're not. You're not. No, absolutely. I mean, yeah, you're really looking for what we're looking for is a diamond in the rough, right? Like we're, we're looking or we're looking for a needle in a haystack. We're, we're yeah, looking and for I feel like analogy. We're looking for how uh, many go to the feed slash. Uh, well, you could probably just answer it. Um, how many of these were listed recently, right? Yeah, like, how far back are we going? Um, I think I pulled up back to like these. These are only in the last uh, some of these are about two weeks old. Yeah, so that's it, right? If There's you're looking lot every week, you will potentially have the ability to find. Yeah, you'll eventually find a needle. good one, but I mean, you got. But how much you are have you to act very really going to make on it? You you have to act fast and you have to be patient. Yeah. You can't fucking take your dick out for the first fat girl that that opens her legs. You know, you you gotta wait. Facts, facts, dude. That's from experience. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What's that uh, Domino's Pizza Project car back there? Let's see if he has any other pictures of it. I don't know. This is just some piece of shit. Coop. Wide-bodied drift car with a Domino sign on it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, never. Sick. Don't buy that. Never buy that. Every time you idiots buy shit like this, uh, you, 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 you just keep perpetuating it. It's an, an small block Ford. Yeah, it's, a, it's a small block at Swab. This is, this is right. awful. <laughs> This is terrible. It's a 302 out of a Fox body. <laughs> is that just something they had lying around? Yeah. Is like every out? every time you idiots pay money for this, you you keep it going. You keep this garbage cycle of trash cars going. I don't know, man. Just, Fiery 302 swap? No. <laughs> this thing's gonna rip at Lime Rock or uh, <laughs> with English Town Raceway. English Town, yeah. No, this sucks. Look, there was a time when when everyone was was uh fucking taking mopar like what they super bees chargers road runners uh camaros chevelles so the drags they're fucking them up putting the biggest motor they could in them souping them up and and you know let's let's see how fast we can take this bitch in a quarter mile but there was a point where it's like the cars became worth too much money where it's like it's not worth fucking these things up in the drag strip because they're they're worth too much money. I'd rather keep it stock, keep it on the street, and that's where we're at right now. Idiots are, are saying, "Oh, it's a stupid drift car. Fuck this thing. It's it's dumb as shit." Yeah. But if I can keep it stock, keep it on the street, keep it running, it's worth way more than than a stupid ass drift car. Yeah. But this one is too far gone at this point. Like, look how cut up it is. This is. Yeah. But that doesn't mean take a stock one and say, oh, this is just stupid ass drift cars as fuck. Actually, you know what? When they made these cars from the factory, they wanted you to, to shit on them and they wanted you to destroy them. So if you don't destroy it, you're actually going against what Nissan wanted. Like, get the fuck out of here, dude. People who think that are just morons. And I know who you're quoted and he's very stupid. <laughs> Benjamin Casperger says, and I, and now all those old Mopars are gone, and I can't have one. And that's exactly right. You can't have one. And that, I can't have one. And that's what one. the uh, the aughts and the early 2010s were for S14s. It's just a living hellscape of, of people chopping them into bits and slamming them into K rails. And that that's that's how things become worth money is because it's things that nobody thought were going to be worth money. It's things that you perceived as disposable. Just yeah. like, just like baseball cards that came in cigarette packs. No one thought, "Oh, look at this dumbass baseball card that came with this pack of fucking two cent cigarettes." I got. Oh, I got fucking Babe Ruth or whoever the fuck. It's a stupid ass baseball card. It's free. Not worth shit. Right. That's what becomes worth money. Oh, look, look at this dumbass comic book I have. Everyone has it. All my friends are reading this stupid ass comic book. Let me throw it away. It's worthless. Oh, know, look, at, look at this new that, series called Action Comics. Look at this jackass yeah. on the cover lifting up a car. Action Comics number one. Everyone has it. We all read it. Spider-Man number throw it 129, away. the introduction to the yeah. Punisher. I hope I got that number right. You don't buy a fucking Star Wars Ray Skywalker collector's edition fucking action figure collector's edition. This is the one that's going to be worth money all over it ruin yeah, it. yeah. <laughs> no but that but that's what i'm saying it's not things that people buy thinking that they're going to be worth money it's the things that that no one thinks is going to be worth money and you th they throw away and get rid of them that because those are the, those are the ones become valuable that that's my i'm i'm really really drunk and i can't you know <laughs> I, 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 I yeah i i, I can't i can't really 
Are you I trying to say just, like is... ditch S14s and let that gear go for the next half hour? <laughs> now nah, we got a few more. He can go while we look at S14s. So we got an S14, $13,000, five days ago, Temecula, California, 115,000 miles, manual transmission, not looking for trades, shoot your offer. Has a Viz body kit or hood or something. I don't know. The front end's kitted. It's got front end wide body fenders. It's got some silly fitment. But overall, the car doesn't look terrible. 13 grand's a bit much for a kitted, stanced S14, though, unless that's like your scene. Quick release. Unless you're Jimmy Oaks. This is. It's not D, though. I mean, this is not terrible. This is probably like a C. Yeah, I did. No. It's a, it's a D plus. The price sucks. That is a D. Alright, we'll give it a D. Here is something truly disgusting. What's this called? The boss kit? What? Yeah. What? It looks like a fake boss kit if I'd have to... Looks like absolute dog shit. AIDS car. Look at the... Oh. Who makes this? Rocket Bunny? Yeah. Yeah, okay, so this is a kit that's supposed to make your car kind of look like a, a Challenger, I guess. And, um, it's hideous. And this sucks. This guy painted his exhaust blue. This guy paid money for this. This looks like it was sprayed with Rust-Oleum. <laughs> like, the whole thing. This is terrible. Oh, no. Lunar says, what is that? And I would like to know the same. 6K OBO. Has navigation radio in it. Quick release steering wheel. Coilovers in the rear and lowering springs in the front. AC needs to be charged. So it's not just a shell. It's an it's a pile of shell. It's a pile. Yeah, it's a pile of shell, isn't it? <laughs> but you it, know it seriously what? looks like it's painted with like house paint, doesn't it? Yeah. Honestly, honestly, for the for the price, if if it wasn't pure cancer, it wouldn't be a bad price. Like if if it was just a normal car. Yeah. If it was just a little rice though. If he hadn't spent thousands of dollars ruining it, it would be. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it'd be a fine price. Okay. Flat black, twelve thousand dollars, ninety six. Has a kooky front end. Has a what is that? RB twenty five. Looking to trade for a manual fun car. It is uh, RB twenty. RB twenty. Yeah. Ooh. This thing is. This thing is whack. That's not a good. That's not a good RB. No. no. Oh. I, I would do an RB twenty Z thirty one for sure. But other than that, I yeah. can't think of any application where I would want an RB twenty. Um, twelve grand for this is crack pipe. Big time crack pipe. If it was a really clean S13 with an RB20 turbo, yeah, okay. I that's it. But I wouldn't pursue it. I wouldn't want it. I wouldn't be proud of it. It would not be what I would look for in a no, S chassis at all. No, the, no, this ev is... everybody that you know that has an RB swapped S chassis has a non-running RB swapped S chassis. <laughs> yeah, yes. Truth. F. F. Fuck it. F. <laughs> uh, I mean, let's let's try to find a good one. How about this one? Was there sold. we go. $151,000, right. and look at the description. Alloy wheels, sunroof, moonroof, air conditioning, cruise control, power locks. This is somebody selling a damn stock car, right? That's yeah. the car yeah. you want to buy. This is the car you want to buy. Not yes. enough information to say for sure, but based off of the price at one hundred fifty k, Easily B. A tier. Yeah. Oh, e yeah. No, this that's is... easily an A tier. For 6200 bucks. If it had more info or more pictures or something, I would say it's an A. But yeah, just going it's, off it's hard to give it an here. A based off of just these two pictures, but yeah. I easily give it a B. Somebody got a steal. No, no. Here, here, here's the A tier. $6,200 manual transmission, those two pictures. A tier. All day. And also, for what it's worth, Rio Rancho, New Mexico. So, Southwest car. Whoa! Hell yeah, New Mexico. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm getting ready. I'm, that's where I'm getting ready to fucking move, dude. Hell I'm yeah. gonna buy one of those. This dude is abandoning Texas. Fuck I it. I don't want to. Fuck Texas. I mean, what? I, I what if I could, dude? <laughs> 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 Alright, we'll give it an A just because. I thought Neck you don't yeah, fuck yeah, with Texas. Texas. This, okay, hey, this is clean. This is clean. $22,000, 97, kooky. Built Turbo K24 DE. Okay, that's Here dumb, comes but... the parts list. Yeah, we're not even gonna look. Stupid body kit, has the dumb duckbill wing. This is stupid. Nah, this is overpriced stupid. Crazy overpriced. I'd rather spend six grand on that one in Rio Rancho. Without <laughs> any information. Yeah, I agree. F. All right. Supreme wheels on this one. Very cool. Uh, 155,000 miles. Very tight. 14, Very tight. Yeah, this is, this is fat. $14,000. <laughs> if you lowball me, I will not respond and I will block you. Price is firm. Tell him the best you can do is five bucks. Looked better before, dude. Yeah, Looked better be yeah. shit still. Should have left it. If if the after was the top picture, fourteen thousand dollars might be reasonable, but it's not. Mm-hmm. It's enough. You wasted your money. Yeah. yeah. 
do not hey listen up kids those heartbreaker do, not, stickers. do not spend money on quote unquote upgrades because guess what they're not upgrades you're you're losing money no one Go. likes it it's stupid everyone makes fun of you you look like an idiot the only people that you think you look cool to are on tiktok and guess what everyone on tiktok's broke as fuck <laughs> <laughs> and they're not even real yeah 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 like clean interior people. though gotta say not bad but no, except for that except for that cringe ass steering wheel yeah cringe mm -hmm. ass steering wheel oh. give me the give me the give me the six pack steering wheel all day what does that say dead boys oh my god it says, <laughs> Please stop making me use the beep. <laughs> this is not a bad word. Beep. 4,800 bucks. 150,000 miles. Weekend special. Rolling shell. Weekend special? What the fuck does that even mean? 4,800 bucks. So after this weekend, he's going to crush it? <laughs> this weekend only. This is F. He sold it, though. I mean, good for him. I mean, it probably is. Honestly, it's not an F. It probably is worth that. I'll give it a D. Again, I'd rather have that one at Rio Rancho for six grand. Absolutely. That that one at Rio Rancho, probably one of the best ones we've looked at. Yeah, that one at Rio Rancho is probably the the <laughs> special. What does that even mean? Ten <laughs> K eighty thousand miles. Looking for a new home. Nothing really bad to say about it. it has a J thirty L S D. Hole in a rocker panel? Oh my god. Oh, there's there's okay. the bad right yep. there. Oh my goodness. Ooh. That's all. Oh. 79k and rockers that look like that. How did you do it? Just left it sitting outside for 20 years. Left it sitting on the beach. That sucks, man. But I mean, and the the fucking steering wheel's not even muscled out, dude. This is probably yeah. the only S14. This is probably the best condition S14 steering wheel I've ever seen in my life. I uh, yeah, I will not. <laughs> I'll not argue with you on that. But ah, those rockers. Too bad. That's too bad, man. Look. You see right in there. That Those underside rocks. is fucked. See that? That's thousands of dollars falling away right there. It's enough. I'm sorry. 96. $9,000. 114 k Factory KA5 speed. Brand new. Flywheel clutch, etc. It's nice. Pretty clean. It says yeah, rust in the rockers. Yeah, oh. I think this car is the I know what I have alternate of the one in Rio Rancho. As far as good deals go. Does it say rust on the rockers? Car has some rust starting on one rocker and one fender at the bottom. Trunk is perfect. Strut towers and frame rails are all clean. Okay, so it's just just starting. That's not the worst. It's not the worst. I mean, I'd really like to see what it looks like up close. But yeah, if there's not a hole straight through the rocker, I mean, whatever. That's not, there's some underside shots there. Yeah, uh, the you, can kinda, you can see it right there on the front of the fender. There's a hole. Yeah, go back one picture, though. But but the, but the thing about it's it is clean. That he's not... He's this, this, this seller is not... The seller's being realistic. The seller's being realistic, you know? He's not Yeah. He's not thinking he he has you know, solid gold. <laughs> yeah, this guy doesn't have solid gold. <laughs> I, I would say no. that this is a C. Hey, this one's not muscled out either. Yeah, look at that. Got a nice looking airbag. These S14 ones not muscled? Gary Duncan should have talked to this guy and swapped fucking airbag covers. Gary Duncan should have contacted this guy, "Hey, we'll swap steering wheels." And then you shield bid for me. <laughs> 170k, twelve thousand dollars. It's a ninety-six. It has an S15 front end conversion. All right, listen. I feel like anybody that says testing waters, those guys get Fs. I'd be inclined to agree. Yeah. Testing waters, F. And S15 front end, S15 front end is like I don't want to sound like an idiot, you know, but it, it it's fucking played the fuck out. Get get over it. It's not cool. Especially, Especially now that the S15s are starting to become street legal here. Right, now that you can get an S15, yeah. 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 No, this is just Especially on an S14, it looks okay. S13, it looks terrible. App. Especially an S13 coupe. The lines do not flow at all. No, it, the it only looks... conversion that looks good with an S15 front end and good is relative... Uh, and an S13 hatch. Those do look yeah halfway decent with the uh, with the S15 front end. That said, fuck that. Yeah, it, it's still it's still not good. You know, do a proper sil80 or leave it alone. Don't even do sil80. That's it, that doesn't flow either. Yeah, but people dig it, dude. Yeah, people. I don't. People. Hate people it. dig it. People. The only reason people dig sil80s is because they like to say, "Oh, it's a sil80." And they want to they wanna say a word that they think other people don't know what it means. So that way they can say, 
Oh, I know well, what you actually, mean. I, I know what you mean. Like, uh, like when you say one V all the time. I did. Oh, <laughs> 97, 240SX, SE Coupe, 20 grand, 138K, glowing. Listing this again as I don't really drive it. Price is firm. Price is crack pipe. Price is crack pipe. <laughs> Is it an SR? Yeah. Yeah, this is towards yep. the ceiling of price. The, the mileage is high. I mean... All right. So this is maybe a D. Maybe a C. Yeah, I'd call it a C. I'd call it a D. I'd call it a D. The kit kind of detracts the, Yeah. Me. I would say a D. If it didn't have the kit and the goofy wing. All right. 121,000 miles. 95. 16K. Not bad. No, not terrible. Is this a factory color? I don't think so. It's got all the badges removed, so I'm gonna guess no. It's pretty though. Those I don't like the wheels. No, the no, wheels, wheels suck. Color's cool. Is that midnight purple? No, that it's purple. Is it Jack purple two or three though? Though all the seats are like sponsored by Tenga. <laughs> They've been filled. Like, yeah. Look at those yeah. bad ones. <laughs> Nothing in here is lined up right. Do you see like no. how the, yeah. that just looks like it's thrown in there? A little bit. It's all been well used. Yeah, I'm, just, I'm going with the F. It's been sharded in. The exterior does not match the interior of this no, car. No, it's strange. This looks like a show car, but then you click yeah. over two more pictures. What the fuck? <laughs> All <Yeah>. right. <laughs> F. F. Here is a 160,000 mile, $15,000, 1995 Nissan 240SX listed a week ago in Houston, Texas. Left-hand drive 240SX with an RB25 DET swap, $15,000, no trades. That's actually not a bad price, really. What, how much, how much? 15 grand. Oh, no, that's not bad at all. With an RB25 that's... Neo in it? I mean, that's yeah, not Yeah, like, this, 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 this guy is is well within the realm of, of feasibility, like. Yeah, this this guy is this guy is realistic. Yeah, the, those taillights are heinous, but that's, yeah, that, that's that. whatever, you know, that's, yeah, that's cosmetic. Yeah, and that's a minor cosmetic issue. I mean, it's bad taste, but it, it's not a big deal. The rest of the body looks pretty good. I mean, these pictures aren't the highest quality, but it's it looks pretty factory. It looks like it has, like, the worst Volks ever made, but whatever, <laughs> they still have Volks. Here is a 95 kooky swap, dumb hood, origin lab, body kit. Uh, What's going on, uh, guys? So obviously the price is not one dollar. T he up for sale is my next ninety-five S fourteen. It's a project I've been working on for a long time. It's my pride and joy. I have a business opportunity <laughs> and I have to let it go. And I'm selling my pride and joy. Stop F. ka. How much have you been really working on this thing, dude? Yeah, uh, like all this is missing is just testing the waters. This is F. <laughs> He's been working on those rivets. He doesn't have a price on it. This is enough. Block this guy. Oh, we have a drinking game, by the way. Uh, no Chill Norris says, drink every time Netgear says <laughs> All right, fuck, I gotta get another beer. You want, oh, you wanna, you wanna play that game, motherfucker? <laughs> He's gonna kill somebody. <laughs> we'll play that game. <laughs> You've been playing along at home. You now have alcohol poisoning. <laughs> 96,000 miles, $5,000 listed a week ago. Basically stock, project car, mechanically sound, runs and drives just fine. I have a lot of parts for this car, including most of the parts required for the cosmetic repair needed. All uh, right. All right, so the, the driver's side quarter is smashed. The front end is destroyed. Ugh. <sighs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Sigh. Oh, it's bad. F. I just... Yeah. Yep. Oh. Yes. Oh. oh! I think I posted this one in Nice Price or Crack Pipe. He cut off the airbag and kept driving it. Yeah, that, this is this is what... This this is what the doctor's looking for when he tells you, like, oh, turn to your turn your head and cough. <laughs> he's looking for... And this pops make, out. Yeah, he's looking to make sure that that didn't happen to you. <laughs> Gross. Oh, this thing sucks, dude. That's gonna do it for this one, guys. The S14 market is pretty damn rough, as you can see, and so is Netgear once he switches from beer to straight whiskey. You made it to the end, so smash like, hit subscribe, and maybe next week we'll have better luck on Facebook. Collector Car Feed, now with over 1,000 subscribers.